am pregnant. <laughs> If Fatal Attraction were made into a Japanese anime horror movie, it would be Catherine. Except instead of finding your rabbit boiling in a pot, you'll find yourself climbing blocks in Dante's Inferno meets Eyes Wide Shut, a study in responsibility, growing up, and commitment. Players take the role of Vincent, average guy in his early 30s who likes to hang out with his buddies in the bar, who finds himself under pressure from his longtime girlfriend Catherine, spelled with a K, to finally make that big commitment. Marriage. Vincent is living out these anxieties and fears as he sleeps in a sadistic nightmarish version of climbing for dollars against sheep. And who is this mysterious Catherine, spelled with a C? A seductive nymphomaniac who wakes up next to Vincent after a night of heavy drinking. And as if that wasn't enough to lose sleep over, oh by the way, your girlfriend is pregnant. Huh? I think I'm pregnant. Way to go, dumbass, and to add insult to injury, the Catherine that you're cheating on the pregnant Catherine with threatens to kill you if you cheat on her. <laughs> cheating? <laughs> Time to hit the bar. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia about whiskey. Now that you've emptied your glass. Who says you can't learn things from video games? Number one, don't cheat on your pregnant girlfriend with an obviously crazy chick. And number two... Here's the difference between whiskey and brandy. Does Vincent do the right thing, take responsibility, and grow up, or does he fall prey to seduction, one night stands, and life as a bachelor? You'll find that you don't have complete control over Vincent. I tried to just make him run away because Catherine seems like way more trouble than she's worth. The, uh, the crazy one, that is. But no matter what decision you make, you're still going to end up climbing blocks in a living hell. It's only at the end that you'll realize how your decisions have affected the outcome of the game. I did it. It's gone. Beneath the Fatal Attraction inspired storyline and stylish visuals, Catherine is a puzzle game and a very challenging one. In fact, I found myself stuck in the middle of the game on the medium setting, so I restarted it on easy, played through the whole thing so I could actually review the game in a timely fashion. For those looking to challenge themselves with the puzzles, play on medium or the harder difficulty setting if you just like to breeze through the storyline, enjoy the visuals and tale of Vincent's internal conflict, play on easy. Which is far, far easier than medium, there's a huge difference between those two settings. And if you enjoy the puzzles, you can play them over and over again, you are being scored, and you earn trophies which unlock songs in the bar. On the surface, it's a weird game, but it makes more sense when you play it from the beginning. And big fans of puzzle games might really dig Catherine. This is a flagship title from Atlas, available on the PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360. This is the PS3 version. And you can find yourself spending hours or days in this game, lounging around the bar, replaying puzzles, drinking different beverages, and learning facts about them. I will forewarn you that heavy drinking will impact Vincent's performance that night as he faces his internal demons while he sleeps, except it's the nightmare on Elm Street, you can actually die in your dream. So, somebody should really tell this guy to maybe just stick to water for a while. Man, this guy is so screwed, it's hilarious to watch his life suck. The funny thing is, the storyline is all about growing up and taking responsibility for your own actions. It represents that point in life when you realize that you can't be a kid forever, and if you'd like to hang on to your girlfriend, you've got to marry her. But what about the seductive blonde that sends him dirty pictures in the bathroom? She's she's crazy, haven't you seen Fatal Attraction? Although his girlfriend seems kind of controlling. Maybe he should just move. So, what do you do? Become the deadbeat dad with the crazy girlfriend or the guy with the ball and chain around his neck? I say that you invite everybody that you know over for drinks, take off, nuke the bar from orbit. It's the only way to be sure that all of your problems are solved. And you don't have to pay for your bar tab. I didn't see that option in the game. Maybe the sequel. Instead, it's climbing for your life before you wake up, before you die. 
Maybe you shouldn't be cheating on your girlfriend. Or is she cheating on you? Wait a second. This guy's life is screwed. <laughs> oh, Vincent, you make such bad decisions. What did you want to talk about? Uh, what are you doing here? Oh. Uh.